Hey guys, it's FIFA Rally here and welcome to episode 6 of Let's FIFA 15 and uh, in this episode we are looking to get the final players off our substitution squad or at least trying to get as many as possible. First off, I opened up my uh, my web app a pack. It was a bronze pack and not really anything good in it and then I jumped into an offline game and uh, decided to play another game in the offline uh, division just to, to get a few more coins and see if I can build my way towards that substitution squad. So we jumped into that game and uh, not really much happened. That was my first game of the day and I played pretty bad. I ended up only winning 3-1 against the semi-pro um, AI. So not really the best of games, but we got the win. We got three points. We got some coins and uh, I also got one of the three packs is from the ultimate edition of FIFA. 15 you get some free packs every week. I guess it is so I kind of um Redeemed that code got a free pack got a rare player there Which I eventually actually would go on to quick sell and uh, I got a few coins into my club as well Picked up a few of the players I needed for my substitution squad and apart from that I got ready to head on into the online divisions division 9 We're kind of closing closing in on winning the title we need four more points so that seems a kind of doable and we have seven games to do it but uh, for my first game I got a terrible start I tried to pass it back no power on the pass and he goes up 1-0 and after that he basically parked the bus he played with that uh, that yeah I guess defensive style that is called the park of the bus and he just had all his players standing back and I really tried to get back into the game I created chance upon chance and I just couldn't score against this guy until the 39th minute. I was able to find Marlos, go past his defender, take a shot and make it a 1-1. One, one and a 40. Yes, finally, I'm back into the game. But straight from the kickoff, a fake shot with Emenike. And look at this. What is my keeper doing? I have no clue. Nice goal though from Emenike. Crazy shot. But terrible performance from my keeper. And once again, he could just go back on that park the bus defensive mode and yeah this game just everything that could go wrong went wrong uh, the pass back to my keeper that situation you just saw there me trying to pass it to the side and somehow passing it straight to him it was just a game where nothing really worked and uh, yeah it was just a terrible game to play but went into the second half and I was looking to get the equalizer because as I said I needed four points uh, to to advance so a draw would be okay so just one goal that was all I was looking for and I really put on the pressure trying to break on through get those shots in on target but it just it just didn't want to work out in this match. It was just like, it was impossible for me to score, even though I created quite a few chances. He would win it 2-1, two, two, two goals by Emenike, who's back on FIFA 15. And yeah, you can see, I just couldn't hit the target. He had quite a few long shots, and then the shots where it just fell apart for my squad. And I ended up losing. It was a really frustrating game to lose because I felt at least it should have been a draw. So I went into another online division game, and this time around... I really wanted to win. I didn't want to lose another game the same way. So we're going to that game. We played four minutes. It's Costa on the ball here. Out in the wing. He breaks into the box. And we get a penalty. A little bit lucky there, I'd say. But Costa, he steps up for the penalty. And we are able to head it into the back of the net. Despite him diving to the right side. And we go up 1-0. Six minutes later, we're on the ball again. Some quick passing. We get on the ball with Costa. And we'll make it 2-0. His second goal of the game, I believe. And we continue on in this game. Where he actually gets... Oh, well. I got a tackle. And then he picked it up. He got a rebound. And 2-1 it was. I just keep on conceding those stupid goals in the game. I need to work a little bit on my defending, I guess. But straight from the kickoff, we're able to go on the attack. With Varela, use his strength, break on through and make it a 3-1. At least I can score goals on the game and then just try to outscore my opponent until I get my defending working. But uh, yeah, 23rd minute, we're on the ball again. Nani stops up and we are up 4-1. Five goals within 23 minutes and three minutes later, terrible defending for me. It is 4-2. So many goals in this game. And we continue on 28th minute, we're on the ball past the keeper. But we hit the post on this shot and instead I I tackled the ball, I lost it, he got it and then it was a 4-3. So 7 goals in the first half. He was getting a little bit ridiculous at this point in time and straight from my kickoff a break on through. He go with a slight tackle and at this point in time he did get his player sent off actually but I didn't score from the free kick. And instead we go into the second half where I would get another goal to make it 5-3. 
and uh, that was pretty much game over at that point in time. I kind of figured out how to defend this guy and he wouldn't really create that many chances and I was looking to score another little nice goal towards the end of the game but unfortunately his keeper would save that one and the game would end at a 5-3. to three. But we get a win in Division 9 and that means we only need one more point to advance into the next division and get a bunch of coins as well. And on our transfer list we sold on a few items with sitting on around 2.5k but I was still holding on with the coins to buy any players because I want to get Hernanis and Gravin both around three to 4,000 coins. So didn't really have enough for them so I went into an offline game into the offline divisions because we're kind of closing in on winning that as well and that is of course another little coin boost we can get from winning the title in that uh, we scored a nice little goal with Ronaldinho and from the kickoff in the second half we we're able to actually run on through and uh, win the game basically 5 to nil. get the maximum amount of coins for the amount of goals we scored and uh, yeah just add to that coin total we had so uh, we had 4744 coins and also sold on a few items I quick sold some of the players I got in my pack earlier and then I went out to pick up Hernanes for 4,000 coins and uh, yeah we're slowly starting to build up our substitution squad as I said from the start of the episode I had another web app pack because this episode was recorded over two days so two web app packs I was able to get for free from locking in online and uh, not really anything good in them whatsoever but still it's a few extra coins and then we went into division 9 we could win the title if we won this game and we played five minutes Costa breaks on through but he cannot hit the target unfortunately and instead a few minutes later Costa is on the ball again he outskills three defenders and he scores a lovely goal to bring us up 1-0 and this was a game with quite a few chances Nani on the ball just a few minutes later breaks through past two three defenders takes the shot but it's on the post it's twice there and I couldn't get the goal unfortunately 19th minute we're on the ball again Cedric he goes past the defender to PZ which got the four star skills past one defender which try out the shot but saved by his keeper 37th minute another chance Costa breaking on through and we actually get a penalty there and um, he was kind of on the ball but he just about missed it, it was almost the perfect slide tackle but luckily enough I did get the penalty I would score and make it 2-0 but the penalty decisions were not over in this game. In the 45th minute, he got a penalty and he would score a goal to make it 2-1. And then 56th minute, I thought I had plenty of space, but Negreta with the strength. And how is that a penalty? I get onto the ball clean with Distin and then he scores in off the bar 2-2 it was and even though a draw was enough for me to uh, win the division title I still wanted to win this game and uh, in the 67th minute we break on through with Nani and for the third time we hit the post with Nani in this game but just two minutes later we break on through Marlis with a few skill moves he finds Costa and we make it a 3-2 and we got a few more chances towards the end of the game going past the keeper tried for the Rabona but failed it big time and we got another chance with Costa in the same minute pretty much past the keeper again tried for the fancy pass this time and in the end it was an own goal but that was pretty much how the game ended 4-2 to two to us and that meant we picked up the division 9 title 5 wins 1 loss and we have a bunch of coins which we will use in the next episodes to finish our substitution squad and play with that with Depay um, and uh, with Charisma, Jackson Martinez and so on. So look forward to that and that will most likely be out tomorrow and that is pretty much all. Thank you for watching and I will talk to you later.